just had a weather forecast for tomorrow for the loadout. Uh, seems we're gonna have uh, fog in the morning, rain in the afternoon, and possible chance on a thunderstorm. Nevertheless, the warranty surveyor is happy to go ahead with the loadout tomorrow based on the wind speeds that he's expecting and the gust, uh, everything is within the limits, so he's gonna give a go ahead probably. In a few minutes uh, we're going to start the side skidded loadout operation of the number one V-board of topside. At the moment everybody's setting up and preparing his equipment. Uh, Samsung is now preparing their level monitoring systems. Dokwise is uh, getting prepared and S uh, also ALE is preparing their uh, equipment to start the finalization of the pre-skidding. Then after that we need to do some welding on the link beams and then we can actually start the skidding operation onto the vessel. Аркадий, пока стоп. Out, uh, tomorrow in the morning. Um, it's going to be towed out at 5.30 in the morning to the float over location and hooked up to the anchor spread uh, for the next two days. So uh, this is what we're looking at at the moment. We've been preparing this for the last uh, week now.
We're now leaving the SHI yard and uh, first going to proceed to the anchorage in, uh, and wait for the hull to be ballasted down to the float overcraft. We expect that to be completed by tomorrow and then uh, on the 4th we uh, intend to move in and do the actual docking operation. V-Borg topside is uh, ready for installation. So we started ballasting the leg, the ballasting the rig, hull actually, and uh, six o'clock in the morning we had the first touch with the rig. By now we've already moved in between columns number five and six. So uh, at first we moored into the spread in the standoff condition and waiting for the move in. Well, as soon as we were moored, the conditions and forecasts looked pretty well. So we decided to uh, do the docking operation r right away. And now we're uh, moved in between the first two columns. We had to ballast the vessel in the stern to uh, be able to catch the crosswires of the stern entry guides. That's